As the temperatures drop, lakes and ponds begin to freeze over. But as one suburban mayor found out, walking on thin ice can be dangerous and even life threatening. He fell through while trying to rescue his dog. As CBS 2's My Martinez reports, he has a mystery jogger to thank for saving him. Twelve-year-old Annie is part of Homewood Mayor Richard Hofeld's family. That's why he didn't hesitate to help the black lab when she fell into icy water at the Isaac Walton Force Preserve Sunday. She was panicking. She, she was really panicking, playing in the water. So every time she would get on the ice, it would break. And I could see she was getting tired. I knew the ice wasn't very sturdy, but I knew I had to get her. And as soon as I reached for her collar, the ice broke and I went under. Hopefeld managed to get Annie onto the ice, but then he couldn't get out of the water. Marilyn watched helplessly from the shore, and that's when out of nowhere a jogger appeared and she asked him to call 911. I'm in the Isaac Walton uh, Forest Preserve and somebody's fallen through the ice. Are they in the water? Yeah, he's, he's, he's in the water. Is they conscious? Are they talking? He, he is conscious. He can't hold on much longer. As Richard continued to struggle to get out of the water, scraping his hands and chin as the ice kept breaking, his wife feared the worst. After a while, he said, I, I, can't, I can't hold on. He was getting so cold or numb or something. And I said, don't you leave me. Don't you leave me. You hang on there. I can hear the sirens. Just hold on. Rescuers arrived in minutes. And they sent two divers in, came behind me, and they put ropes under me, pulled me out. Once he was safe, the Hofelds noticed the jogger was gone, but they say he'll never be forgotten. He is the most wonderful person in the world. He saved my husband, really. Mm -hmm. I wish I knew his name. Despite being in the water for about 20 minutes, Hofeld is doing fine. You can see him there. Annie is also okay. The Hofelds say they hope their close call will remind people to keep dogs on a leash and to always carry a cell phone. Rob and Erica, the Hofelds hope to thank that jogger in person. He wants to keep a low profile, right? He does. That's what we're hearing. But let's hope they can have some kind of reunion. Yeah, yes. Mm -hmm. Incredible. Thank yes. you, Mike.